Hi, Emma. Here's how I would go about doing what it is you described. When you open up DM, this is what you should see. If I were working through the entire list of pages here, um, I would simply start with the first one, click it, open it up as usual. And if it's the case that you're checking on um, annotations that are already there, um, go ahead and work with the markers that are here. Um, if you're creating something new, what I would what I would do is create the marker you need, whatever that is, and then create an annotation from this interface, from this menu. So if I want to create something, an annotation that targets this particular region, I can bring up this context menu and click the annotate this button. Okay, then you can punch in whatever new content you want. Um, okay, now once you've created a new annotation, then if you hover back over the marker that you have just created an annotation targeting, you'll see that new annotation show up in the list of annotations for the marker. All right, and I can do this with as many annotations as I want. So if I create another annotation, I'm going to label this one differently. Okay, you will see that second annotation appear. Okay, now it takes about 10 seconds for it to automatically save. So what we're seeing here um, as the second one in the list is actually this one over here on this side of the screen. It's just that it hasn't quite saved out that new title yet. Okay, and there we have it. All right, now we're seeing it here. Okay, so you can use this menu not just to see whether or not the annotation was created, but to navigate back to the annotation itself. So if I want to go back to that first one I made, I can click here and open it up. Okay, so what I'd recommend as a process is drawing whatever markers you need, creating annotations from the context menu um, that appears when you hover over the marker. If you're trying to annotate an entire image, um, you can get that same sort of context menu from here and use this button. Okay. Um, when you're ready to do the next image, just use the back button, go back, click on the next one in the list, whatever list it is you're working from, and do something similar. All right, create another annotation, and I'll go back through and delete these um, so that you guys don't have to clean up the data. Um, but here now I can hover, all right, and I can create a new annotation. If you need to, you can always copy and paste in your annotation template and work from that in one of these new annotations that you've created. Okay, so now, all right, got our new test annotation here. All right, you can see that the, that the annotation was created all as well. Let's say I do, in fact, want to create an annotation to this entire image, targeting this entire image. Well, I can do that, too. All right. Okay, pardon the interruption, my phone rang. All right, and we're good. All right. And there is that annotation we've just created. Okay, so in this version of the interface, um, which I'm hoping you're using, um, we have 
done away with the radial style menus in favor of the, this type of menu precisely so that um, you get immediate feedback as to which annotations you've created and so that when you're working with already created data um, from you know prior sessions using DM you can go through and look at any of the annotations that target a particular region of interest and you can actually open them up okay likewise on the other panel in the other panel if I hover over any of these I'm gonna see all the things that are targeted by any one of these okay all right so if you have any questions be happy to set up a Skype or um, I can uh, make another screencast or two to um, help clear up any any questions you have so just to summarize what I'd recommend is start with the fresh version of the of the interface and just work through this panel in sequence finding each of the pages that you need in turn pop it open all right and do whatever work it is you need to do um, creating a marker all right creating an annotation to it all right creating other an annotations as needed and then simply moving on okay let me know if you have any questions.